Hi, it's Michael and I'm back with Javier Leon, one of the artists from Guatemala here at our second home. Javier, nice to meet you. Thank you, Michael. I've heard lots about you. Oh, thank you. So you are a photographer? I do. Uh, yes, I am. Yes. And when we had our show at the Mexican trade office, you were traveling. So you weren't able to join that one, but you're here today and these are your photos and where are they from? Where did you take these photos? All of these photos on this side, they are from Taiwan. Okay. Yes. And Alejandro was telling me that you had some sort of, um, uh, you were given permission to go to some mm -hmm. little island and... Oh yes, sure. Um, so these three fo photos, they're actually shot in uh, Dongsha Atoll, okay. which is a uh, one of the seven national parks from Taiwan. Right. But it's also a, mil a military island. Right. And it's um, only, it's basically close to the public. Right. So in order to get there, yes, you are either have to be from the military or go on uh, something like an, on a mission with uh, the Marine Research Center. Okay. So for me, it was the second one, of course, and okay. I. I managed to get a collaboration with Wonderful. the cameras that sponsor me for this, right. which is Olympus Taiwan. Right. And they, together with national parks, they managed to get a like permit for me okay. to take some photos and update their database for aerial photography and right. for underwater. Okay. Yeah. And uh, Alejandro was saying something. You stayed there like a week or something. Yes. Yeah, so uh, can you believe there's actually only one flight? So if you arrive on Wednesday. Right. The next time you can leave is so next Wednesday. Okay. So that's why I was I had no other choice but to stay there for a week. Right. Yeah. <laughs> and where is it? It's south of Taiwan. You wouldn't believe, but it's the location is right in between Manila, Hong Kong, and Kaohsiung. Oh, so okay. if you draw a triangle, this thing is in the middle. Right in the middle. Yeah. Okay. Right in the middle. So it has a flight. You took the flight, and then do, where do you stay? Do they have facilities there? Yes, they have. Okay. I stayed at the Marine Research Center. Okay. They have some like dorms. Right. So you, it's pretty. So yeah, it's comfortable. It's comfortable. So you're not camping on the beach. Right? Not camping on the beach. No. I would okay. say it's definitely com comfortable. And then this, you're here. Is this a reef shark? Yes, this is a lemon shark. Lemon reef shark. shark. Yeah. And <laughs> as you can see, there's a little bit of water. That's yeah. why it gives that effect. Yeah, no, it's wonderful. And it must have been so amazing to be somewhere so not public and, you know, no pollution, no trash or anything. And you're recording what life is there. And that was part of your project? Yes, okay. that was part of it. And I also did a, like, a like a vlog okay. of, of my experience there. Okay. So I, I really wanted to just make as much as content as possible. And is that on Instagram? That's on my YouTube channel. Okay, yes. so we'll have to get that from <laughs> Javier. And we'll you. get that information and put it on there as well. So you, you did this one and the, that was sponsored by the government of Taiwan. Yes. And then this last trip you were on was to Iceland. That, that was my last last uh, trip, okay. but actually the one that is in this exhibition is in this t on this TV. Okay. This is from earlier this year in February and uh, January. I went to Kashmir region, oh, um, the, um, the area that is controlled by India. Right. So that is Ladakh. Yes. And I spent uh, two weeks and a half. Right. And it's during winter, right. so you can imagine it's pretty cold. Yeah. Because it's sandwiched between the Himalayas and the Karakoram range. Yes, yes. So both ways, you, you can't, it's like the only accessible way is by air. Because right. all the roads are closed yes. because of the snow. Right. And how did you get invited to that? Uh, that was a personal uh, trip. I, okay. I wanted to do it by myself. Okay. And. Uh, after that, I was heading to a yoga meditation course for one month. Right. So that's why I, I wanted to just um, justify my yeah, stay there. doing something. But isn't it a difficult region to get to because of the political turmoil between Pakistan and India? And it is. Yeah. It is actually the three big powers and China, China Pakistan and, and yeah. India. They all have um, frictions, yeah. and especially the area where I went, it's closer to the Chinese border. Right. So a few years ago, there was a standoff between like the two militaries. Yeah. So there's a lot of tension, and if I'm flying my drone, I have to be extremely careful. Yes. Yeah. Especially with the, yes. the Chinese. But actually, the safest um, 
side is from India. Yes. That is the only one that tourists are allowed. Yes. In Pakistan and China, yes. it's, it's not possible. And if you go anywhere, I always meet Kashmiri people and they're the nicest people. Yes. Even in Malaysia, yeah. I've met people. So this, these ones here are from Taiwan and then this is from that area in Kashmir. Yes. And then what about this one here? Um, th this one here is in uh, Jamin, okay. which is another hike, one of the major big hikes from Taiwan. Right. Um, and this one in particular is not is a bit different because it's not like you go up on a mountain. Right. But this one you go along the ridge. Yes. And then you find uh, the angel steer, which is like a small pond. Right. And this is on the way. Wow. Yeah. And is that you? Yes, actually, I'm taking the photo with my right hand, so that's why you cannot see the control. Oh my god! <laughs> that's, and how do you? So you have the camera set up? It's, it's a drone. Oh, it's a drone. It's a drone. Oh wow! Yeah. It's so cool. And then this is also. And then this one. This is. This was shot in Huansan, in Uling. Okay. I I tried to do that once a year, like a meditation retreat for myself I just right. go by myself right this is one of the safest spots because here you get signal yeah so it, in, if you have an emergency at least you can call right yeah and so you're doing some sort of exposure so you're able to pick up the light and everything yes it's a long exposure around 15 seconds wow. so I need to stand still and yeah, yeah that's, that's the only way yeah, you can get this incredible. I don't know if you can pick up all the stars. Fixed. Yeah, Fixed. I don't know if you can see all the stars there, but it's wonderful. So now that Javier is back from Iceland, we hope to see you more at different events because he is cousins with Alejandra, and if you know her, she's everywhere. Mucho gusto, felicidades. Muchas gracias. Están buenísimos. Te agradezco mucho. Gracias. And let's go talk to some more artists.